समुंदर है सर जिसको जितना दम है मारो चलने दो कंपटीशन होने दो एक दूसरे के कपड़े फाड़ते रहेंगे प्राइस कम होती रहे <laughs> आप किसी एक को प्रोटेक्ट मत करो अब हर आदमी सोच रहा कि वो कंपनी कितनी कॉस्ट लग रही है वो बोल रही वो कितनी दे रही है मैं ये दूंगा वो दूंगा अगर मोनोपल्ली हो जाती है वो स्टील सीमेंट वाला मामला होता है अभी मैंने स्टील और सीमेंट के भी अल्टरनेटिव ढूंढना शुरू कर दिया हमने ग्लास फाइबर स्टील को अलाउ किया सीमेंट के अल्टरनेटिव ला रहे जिस दिन पचास लोग आ जाएंगे इनके भाव जमीन पर रहेंगे नाउ इलेक्ट्रिक ट्रक फ्रॉम थ्री फोर मैन्युफैक्चर इज रेडी दे आर इन पोजिशन टू लॉन्च दैट देन ट्रॉली बस एंड इवन इलेक्ट्रिक केबल वी कैन रन द ट्रक ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ दर एंड लॉन्च वन एल एन जी ट्रक फ्रॉम ब्लू एनर्जी इन पुणे एंड दे हैव द कैपेसिटी ऑफ फोर्टीन हंड्रेड किलोमीटर जस्ट मिस्टर ही वॉज टेलिंग मी दैट Dalmi has purchased twenty trucks. My target is I am trying for that to get the green hydrogen with one dollar per kg, where four hundred fifty kilometer average for the car is there, and four hundred startup the intelligent engineer they are starting manufacturing of e-scooters, and everywhere the people are doing excellent jobs, new designs, new technology, new innovations. Now we have already working on battery chemistry. It is not only that uh, lithium-ion battery we need. We are already developing the battery chemistry, the sodium ion, zinc ion, aluminium ion, and the latest technology from Indian oil, that aluminium air technology is economically viable. And now we are the number five as far as the growth is concerned in the world. And the most important thing is there is a good competition. First of all presently in the road infrastructure there was lot of problem because traffic jam congestion delays then from north to south you don't need to go to mumbai and pune it is going to reduce the time and also reduce the uh, kilometer because it goes through uh, because mumbai and pune there is lot of congestion and also air pollution is there so my suggestion is by developing this new road infrastructure the we will reduce the time reduce the pollution but regarding road construction there is good development but at the same time we need to concentrate on fuel now already in indian scenario the things are moving very fast now actually diesel and petrol is a hazardous fuel and i have a very strong reaction about it and now this is the time that we can give alternative fuel for example now electric truck from 3 4 manufacturer is ready they are in position to launch that then trolley bus and even electric cable we can run the truck on the basis of that my idea is to first e highway making it from delhi to jaipur the road is ready nadiyo highway and we will open just two three month after that and we want to make it e highway so for passenger and for goods it's really good the electric is a cheaper fuel actually in our ba- power basket the 40% 38% of the power is solar power and the target is that we have we the target is from the prime minister that we will take 60% of the power with the solar power just uh, 20 days before i launch one lng truck from blue energy in pune and they have the capacity of 1400 km just mr he was telling me that dalmi has purchased 20 trucks so that will change the economics because the cost of the diesel and cost of the lng is a 50% probably no presently because of the ukraine war the gas price is higher side mm-hmm. but my idea is making uh, this uh, bio lng and bio cng from rice straw mm-hmm. now already successfully we have the plant in uh, panipat of indian oil mm-hmm. they are making 150 ton bitumen per day from parali that is rice straw and 1 lakh liter of bioethanol methanol truck in the country the usa canada china everywhere the methanol engines are there mm-hmm. even in uh, particularly in the waterways mm-hmm. and sea transport my idea was to launch a methanol engines mm-hmm. so 22 rupees per liter methanol is there and the diesel rate is very high so at the same time we can make bio cng in bio cng the last important thing which is the future for the industry that is hydrogen mm-hmm. we got we can make hydrogen from coal that is black hydrogen from petroleum that is brown hydrogen and we can make green hydrogen from water mm-hmm. from the sewage water we make the we can make this recycling of the water mm-hmm. and rooftop solar because the 70%
cost in making green hydrogen is power. So by solar we will get the green hydrogen. Uh, my target is I am trying for that to get the green hydrogen with one dollar per kg, where 450 kilometer average for the car is there. Mm -hmm. Now the lot of atwell companies they are making hydrogen fuel cell technology is there, mm -hmm. and so buses and trucks. I am expecting within within a year there will be lot of trucks and buses with the hydrogen. My suggestion is the person who have got the certificate of scrapping the truck or car, if there is some incentives from the manufacturers, mm. it can also be a good thing. Right. So all this process and system which we are changing, in due course of time there will be a transformation in the transport sector, mm. either it is passenger or goods and 100% it is going to uh, reduce the logistic cost. Actually frankly speaking, we have import of copper, aluminium, rubber, plastic and steel. So my suggestion is that the scrapping policy is the most beneficial to the Atwell manufacturer. Now in every district, we can open three scrapping centers, the economic viability is there, the fitness center and scrapping center. The problem is that where I am expecting from the Atwell industry, if they can make the joint ventures in different areas, they will get aluminum, steel, copper, rubber and plastic with a very, very reasonable rate actually what my prediction about is that they can reduce the cost of their components by 30%. So it is beneficial to Atwell industry and that the reason now I will request Atwell industry to start the scrapping centers in India and we can start at least 2000 scrapping centers. I, never, I don't want to give the answer for that. Now I am just, I am using electric car. Now many people, suppose a journalist, if you are, if you have a petrol car, your expenditure is 15,000 rupees per month. With the same comforts or more comforts, if your expenditure will be 2,000 rupees, it is not important that it is not uh, you want to convince that. Already, the rise in electric manufacture vehicle, you just understand. Now there is a waiting list. Mm -hmm. And 400 startup, the intelligent engineer, they are starting manufacturing of e-scooters. And everywhere the people are doing excellent jobs, new designs, new technology, new innovations. Now we have already working on battery chemistry. It is not only that uh, lithium ion battery we need. We are already developing the battery chemistry, the sodium ion, zinc ion, aluminum ion. And the latest technology from Indian oil, that aluminum air technology is economically viable. And now the green hydrogen fuel technology is also available. I feel that by adopting the new technology, it is win-win for all the sectors. We have a requirement of 10 lakh buses in the country. Mm. From Delhi to Ludhiana, air conditioned electric. Now we just launched electric double-decker bus. Mm. So there is a huge potential. We have received the tender. For non-AC bus, it is 39 rupees per kilometer. For AC bus, it is 41 rupees per kilometer. And double-decker electric bus, it is 58 to 60 rupees per kilometer and the best presently running their diesel bus the cost is 115 rupees per kilometer same thing for the truck so if the huge saving is there just to take his, his uh, experience if he can make LNG truck what is to be saving on the cost I don't need to convince them if there is a saving everyone transporter is going to purchase that truck because economics is there I, I feel that within two years the car, pet car, the price of the petrol car and electric car will be the same. So there is a competition. Samundar is there, jisko jitna dham hai maro chalne do, competition honne do, ek dusre ke kapde paadte rahenge, price kam hoti rahenge. Aap kisi ek ko protect mat karo. Ab har admi soch raha ki wo company kitni cost lag rahi, wo bol rahi, wo kitni de rahi, mahi ye dunga, wo dunga. Agar monopoly ho jai thi, wo steel cement wala maamla hota hai. Abhi mainne steel or cement ke bhi alternative dhunna shuru kar diya. Amne glass fiber steel ko allow kiya. सीमेंट के अल्टरनेटिव ला रहे जिस दिन 50 लोग आ जाएंगे इनके भाव जमीन पर रहेंगे अगर अगर ये मोनोपोली हो जाएगी मैं सीमेंट रोड करने का तय किया था इन्होंने कार्टेल करके भाव बढ़ा दिए मैंने बोलना बंद कर दिया अभी जैसे अल्टरनेटिव तैयार होंगे नेचुरली 10 अल्टरनेटिव हो गए तो कॉम्पिटिटिव प्राइस होगी और एक्सपोर्ट बढ़ेगा तो आई फील दैट इट इज अ विन-विन सिचुएशन फॉर ऑल द स्टेक होल्डर्स एंड दिस ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन इज गोइंग टू बी हैपन We don't need any push-up or any support. Government is already positive and supportive.